Our jail and prison overcrowding continue to be a big topic of conversation across Idaho, really. And today, the Canyon County Sheriff's Office announced a brand new resource to show the extent of the problem in Canyon County. KTVB's Joe Paris shows us the system and explains why it's being put to work. A major topic of conversation over the last few years has been over how many people are inside the Canyon County Jail. Well, Canyon County officials came together and decided they wanted everyone to know in the air transparency exactly what the jail roster looks like. Announced this morning, Canyon County alongside the Canyon County Sheriff's Office released this, a brand new web page where you can see every day exactly what the capacity is of the Canyon County Jail. Sorted by offender type, you can see the percentage full as well as the individual amount of inmates that are in the cell blocks at any time. Canyon County tells us they want to do this in terms of transparency so they can get the information out easily. Transparency, just get the information out and educate all of our public because it's, it's very widely known Canyon County has had an issue with jail overcrowding for many years, but there's been missing that component of education to get that word out. People all know that they hear it, but this they can dig into it and actually see it for themselves and see the type of inmates that we are housing in custody. Coming up later this summer, Canyon County will be adding on to their jail with a temporary facility that will open dozens of new beds up and get some more space for the county that again is constantly faced with jail overcrowding. Canyon County tells me that that brand new facility will be integrated into this computer system right away. If you want to check out the Canyon County jail system, you can go onto their website. You can click on the main page and it's easily accessible to again find out at any time what the jail capacity is here in Canyon County. Reporting from the Canyon County jail, Joe Paris, Idaho's News Channel 7.